The new package of House rules and reforms that Democrats plan to approve has a surprising local supporter and a big impact on a Western New York congressman. Yep, Republican Tom Reed says that he is voting with the Democrats on the new rules. The first time a member of Congress has crossed party lines of this kind of vote in 18 years. He says that he supports a lot of the changes that encourage bipartisanship. The reforms also include a ban on Congress members from serving on the boards of public corporations, which is part of what got Congressman Chris Collins implicated in an insider trading case. Another reform bans Congress members under indictment, like Collins, from serving on committees. And political strategist Carl Calabrese joins us in studio. Let's talk about Tom Reed first, Carl. Uh, is this a surprise to you, and how significant is this? It's not so surprising to me, given Tom Reed's recent background. Tom Reed is now chairman of a group called the Problem Solvers. It's a bipartisan group uh, that always has to be balanced, equal number of Republicans and Democrats, trying to find common ground, compromise, and break out of this polarization that we, we're in now in this country. All right, let's talk about the new House rules also. And it appears that it will affect Congressman Chris Collins here uh, locally. No committee member under indictment or on a corporate board. Right. I, the first thing that got me about that, that corporate board ruling is why do you, do you even need to pass it? Given the problems Congressman Collins uh, is in because of membership on a corporate board, I would think that the average member of com uh, Congress would avoid serving on a corporate board as if it were a leper colony. Right. Okay. For I mean, transparency. Yeah, I don't think you need right. a law, but it, it's, it, it's probably necessary in, in some ways. But just from a practical political standpoint, uh, there's no good that can come from this. And, and quickly, how effective can Chris Collins be then, if these rules are, are going in? Well, if, if he can't be on a committee, it certainly puts a damper on the types of legislation he can, he can pursue. Uh, he still can do constituent service and, and those types of things and, and vote on bills, and that, that has a value. But uh, it, it, certainly, it certainly hampers you, no, and you're effective. There's no question about it. Political strategist Carl Calabrese in studio. Carl, always great to have you here. Good to be here. Thanks for your time.